Good morning. Hope you're having a, a fantastic Saturday. I am trying to fix my sound levels and I don't know if I did it or not. Uh, I tried. <laughs> so if the sound levels are all wonky, uh, well, my bad, but I don't know what to do about it. I don't have a sound guy. <laughs> Just shout at me in the comments uh, and tell me to do better. All right. Anyway, we are playing the Goth Mansion today. I just wanted to do this because I wanted to see how it looks. See, they they have oop, oh my goodness, they have sort of a view of the ocean if you look the right way and not that way where there's a big house and there's a sailboat so cute uh, I wish <laughs> I wish the houses were a better resolved in this view but we can't have that <laughs> unfortunately the reason being the reason being that um, the Sims 2 only uses two gigabyte of RAM <laughs> this is silly but okay so uh, by default it just uses two gigabyte of RAM and you can there is a mod or hack that makes it use four gigabytes Woohoo! double the amount and we can have more textures but four gigabytes is still not that much in today's era back in the day it wasn't as visible because our screens weren't you saw that square on the middle of the screen that's the size of our screens we didn't have better resolution than that uh, most of the time so it wasn't noticeable but nowadays we want high resolution so <laughs> i mean my game is better resolved than i am <laughs> because I haven't turned the light on, mainly. There! Now, I look like a ghost. But we will have to deal with it, because it's just, uh, that's just my skin color. <laughs> you know? I can't help it. Um, well, we are today playing the goth mansion, uh, which is this house, and I was contemplating beforehand because Alexander here has been naughty. <laughs> He's been, Hello, you're early. I never get one early as this. <laughs> How are you? Anyway, <laughs> Alexander here has uh, he's, he's been naughty. He has been fighting. It was actually over at the prison. I was having a party at the prison. And he got into a fight. And I have now decided I am not throwing parties over there anymore. If anyone in the prison is uh, to, <laughs> to focus on getting not angry with people. <laughs> Which version of the game are you playing? Is it Ultimate Collection or the Super? It's Ultimate because I got it when they, uh, when they offered it for free. It was the Ultimate Collection. So I got it on Origin. I do have the disc, but that's not a collection. It's just a collection of discs <laughs> that I have gathered. <laughs> we have the green wallpaper. Yes, this is default. Uh, I, I usually don't change much in the houses. <laughs> um, except that I did, I think. I don't know. I might have changed these rooms. And also, I have built this room. Uh, yeah. So, so yeah. <laughs> changed a little bit. But, um, you remember that wallpaper that looked kind of like this, but blue in The Sims 1? Uh, I never changed that out either. So, that's real nostalgic for me. I think I have that wallpaper in The Sims 2, like a CC or something. Oh my goodness. Oh, he wants to have a baby. Right. Okay. So I was worried that I had to just play one day because Alexander was going to prison for his uh, incessant fighting. But 
uh, the prison is actually full and there's a queue <laughs> because I have a lot of fighting in my neighborhood and I wasn't going to but I think I am going to build a second prison because I have been taking the oldest ones I can show you my spreadsheet it's it's wild um, here it is we have a criminal record for a lot of people and if we hang on if we remove all the blanks and we can see I have a script that makes these blue if they have not served their prison sentence yet oh my goodness that made me white <laughs> oh well <laughs> um, so that there's quite a lot of them and I can't fit them all so and then a thing happened with a girl named Gina she has a record so she should be going to prison but no, I can't get it back uh, okay okay it's it's good again <laughs> so she's a teenager and she has a prison sentence and she's in the orphanage and she got herself pregnant and I was like, I gotta deal with that. But if I just move the oldest ones that has a criminal record into the prison, then she'll never go. Uh, and I need to deal with her now. So I thought i will build a second prison and that prison will take in the youngest ones, <laughs> I think, uh, to see, correct them and you know it, it will have a function they will learn conflict resolution in there that's their first goal and then they have to make make up with anyone that they are furious with so they can't be furious or have any enemies then they can be released <laughs> into the wild and i have some logical prison token on all of them so that they shouldn't be wandering around <sighs> so that's the prison situation. So Alexander is not going anytime soon uh, because it's full. <laughs> but he has a record and they they have noticed him that you will have to serve um, two years for your second offense of fighting because he has already served one year. He did... Oh my goodness, we've got roaches. Uh, should be take care of these because you know we have staff and I should who has money I need to make sure we have more money in the account uh, Alexander is holding a lot of money but Cornelius it's it's his house and he uh, he has more money so I'll have him withdraw See, he has, he has 96,000, so he will withdraw. I think a thousand is enough for now. He was going to do something, I don't know. First, we, we will deal with the roaches. Diana Goth is the daughter of Alexander and Lucy Goth. And they are just like Alexander and Lucy. It says to save my game. I it, hardly anything has happened, but my chat bot says, <laughs> so we better do it. <clears throat> anyway, um, Alexander and Lucy is like holding the estate for Cornelius. Like right now, they're not, but <clears throat> they will be because Cornelius obviously wants to go to college. What happened to my voice? <clears throat> I'm so sorry about that and when he goes to college if no one was living here uh, the house would obviously go up for sale and someone could snatch it or something uh, I did I don't want that <laughs> oh no oh no she's dying oh my god <clears throat> I have uh, a bad track record of pregnant sims not eating and getting dead <laughs> because they, they starve to death so i'm gonna make sure she eats because i want this baby it's a little brother or sister to 
Diana and uh, let's take this one hello butler you haven't been doing your job because we don't have anything to eat what is he doing oh he's going to take care of the roaches that's great maybe she needs to eat two bowls Luke Knight uh, took it upon himself to order a exterminator and that's good because we cannot be bothered with such things even though Alexander went out there to <laughs> pick up the garbage. Uh, he wants to get a job in the music career uh, so I'm gonna try and give him that he doesn't have a lifetime want to have a job, so that's probably why I locked it in. Uh, where's the computer? Oh my goodness, the computer broke. Will the butler fix it? I think he will. Well, we could look in the newspaper, I guess. If we have one. Oh, there it is. We also have these flowers, I don't know. Uh, find a job, see if there's a music career. Should be on the computer because, whoops, what is happening? Is Lucy having a baby bump moment or something else? It took me to this floor, but I don't, I'm not sure. What happened? <laughs> All right, so those were flowers from Lucy to Alexander. Well, it's risky to view flowers actually, <laughs> because if you, if you, view flowers and they're from somebody else to your significant other you will get furious with your significant other um but luckily nothing funky was going on lucy wants to ask sim on a date she also wants to be friends with gina that's the girl in trouble <laughs> so well let's let's call her then she should be in school though. Oh dear, Cornelius' grades are not good at all. So he will not be going to college tomorrow because uh, he, his grades are too bad. There is an opening in the show business career. Oh, but he wanted a music career, I think. That's not the same. <laughs> I think it was. <clears throat> I wish these symbols were on here because then it would be easier for me. This is the music career, yes, law and forms. New. So we only get three jobs in the newspaper, but in the computer you get five. So we will we will check there once it's fixed, unless Luke Knight will uh, electrocute himself on this one. Well, I think it's gonna be fine. Okay, who was who was it calling? Gina. I think just talk. Oh, she's not in school yet. Right, so she's on the bus. Or haven't gone yet, I don't know. Lucy, you are living in the Goth mansion. You should not be wandering around. Uh, in your nightgown that that's not how we do here and alexander you too <laughs> have some decency and find a job like comb your hair get a job there you go i'm gonna speed through this Adventure. These are different jobs, I think. No, it's not. Entertainment. Now, let's see. Show business. No. Law enforcement. No. No. So, there was no job for the music career, but he will tr keep trying. One of these days, he might get a job. <laughs> he will lose it once he goes to prison, because you can't have a job in prison. Once you go to prison, you're Workplace says, uh, no, <laughs> we don't want you, but you know, 
uh, I, I figure like, I don't know what I figure. I want him to have a job because like, how will he get, how will he make any money? We could go, they're both pretty fine. Oh, we need to go actually. Yes, uh, we will go to the pool with these two. It is, I think we can manage that. Uh, call taxi. Because it's owned by Cornelis. What? Why can't I go here? Don't we have a phone up here? We have a phone here. Call taxi. So, okay, so the pool is owned by Cornelis. And last time he was there, he started to make hot dogs. <laughs> and, <laughs> and then he left a lot. So every time I go there with different sims, the hot dogs burn and they, st <laughs> they start a fire, like every time. And I take my sims there on dates. And the dates, <laughs> <laughs> the dates go to horrible immediately because there's a fire. Nobody wants that. So, <laughs> so I need to fix that. I need to get those hot dogs off the grill. Or, you know, um, at least extinguish the fire. So we will go there. See, we own these lots. Uh, this is the pool. Yes, we need to go there. I have an errand. <laughs> To get some hot dogs off the grill. Uh, don't bother with those. The butler can take care of those. Oh my goodness. And we're getting bills. And the bills should be horrible now. Because I've changed it. So. Uh, we have here the loan jar. That we don't have a loan. But we have global billing level 6. Uh, that's the worst I could do. <laughs> So the, this mansion is worth quite a lot, so I'm expecting these bills to be awful. Uh, but serves them right for living in such a big house, I guess. It's how the city council um, can afford to build stuff. There they go. So... Let's pause the minute we go there. The, the second we... It's gonna have to start a fire no matter what I do. Because while while uh, Cornelius was walking off the lot, it, it kind of started to, to burn. So there's like no way to, to actually not have a fire, I think. Well, we can try. See? We could try not to get a fire, but it's already a fire. So Alexander, you need to go here and uh, actually, should we call fire department on this? Like, I don't think Alexander would, would he? I don't know. Let's, let's try. Do, do, does he have a mobile phone? No. And other sims can buy one here, but I can't because I, I've set it to... Uh, it's for sale. Otherwise, other sims couldn't buy that. It's, it's a whole deal. So, call emergency. There you go. Hurry. Lucy, don't go there. It's a fire. You also try and call em emergency. Call emergency. Because I don't want your pregnant self running over there. I said, don't do it. Oh my goodness, why can't you just call emergency? There's a fire. Don't run to the fire. Call an emergency. You can get into the pool. <laughs> that, that's a better way to spend your time. <clears throat> oh, he, he doesn't want... He's too scared to call an emergency. What? This is this is very annoying. Call emergency. Go, go do it. Oh, yeah, but okay. Well, extinguish the fire then. If you're so stubborn, I can't. <coughs> I can't deal anymore. There we go. 
Well, okay. I told you. Okay. <sighs> well. At least, because now, after this, we, we can save and there won't be a fire. But I hope none of them die, because that would be inconvenient for me. <laughs> I don't want them to die. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, we lost the star. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, try to greet him. This is weird freckles. I gave him... <laughs> I gave him a slight face lift. <laughs> so that it doesn't look like an alien anymore. But I'm not sure. Like, I did, I did it like this. Like, uh, gussy up and then plastic surgery. You can change their looks. But I don't know if that changes the genetics or not. But we will know because he has a baby on his way. <laughs> yep, yeah. I know. Oh, you're looking for the phones? Yeah, I would like to have one too. <clears throat> I'll show it to you. It's right this way, sir. There you go. There they are. <laughs> he has they're over there. You can go there yourself. I'm going to stay here by the pool. <laughs> okay. That, that's logical. And while we're here, I'm going to change set price. I'm going to change that a little bit to average. Oh, that's just, that's 25. Uh, usually when I'm not I'm, I'm trying to leave it like on 10 simoleons because I think it's very expensive um, for my sims to go there, but I want to make money. Yeah? So now there's a queue. Oh, and Weird Freckles likes the intended for the orphanage, but I'm sh pretty sure she's gay. She is at least bi. I know, I know for a fact that she's not straight. She was kissing Chloe broke. Uh, she, oh, she was Chloe Aldi back then. But Chloe is straight, so I don't know what she was doing. Is Chloe here? No, that's not Chloe. That Elvira. All right. Okay. Lester Pleasant is here. And apparently I'm letting Lucy do whatever she wants because she's pregnant. She can get the hot dogs. Because we need to make sure she eats. What's wrong with you? Oh, right. I was annoyed before that there were no showers in this lot and we can fix that. Because after you, after you take a dip in the pool, wouldn't you want to shower? Yes, I think you would. I'm gonna do this, and then we're gonna put wall no doors of some kind like this. I'm gonna turn move objects off so that I get get this snappy snap. Okay, I can put it there apparently and there and then we're gonna have where are they like a soul I find it interesting that in the Sims 2 we do not have a search function but most things I think is easier to find than in the Sims Sims 4 there are a few things Yesterday I was looking for a, a wheel for the the caravans, um, but I couldn't find it. But then I I found one that I had put up somewhere, or it was put up. It it was on the wall somewhere. So I found out it's under wall hangings <clears throat> because it's something that you hang on the wall. And here we have a great wheel that we can put. I don't know how to get it uh, further down. 
I think there's a way to do that, but I don't know how, what it is. <laughs> I'll figure it out later. So uh, I could put wheels below the caravans and it will look like caravans. Because in the trailer park we have, I don't know, no, it's not in this area. Is it? It is, wait. It's not loaded in. Oh, right. Here it is. I built this little caravan yesterday. This is the trailer park. I added the trailer, actual trailer park where you can rent just one trailer. And look, they have wheels somehow. And I wanted to put that on this one too, but I couldn't. So <laughs> I will have to uh, um, figure that out. These ones have it. So. <clears throat> I didn't build those, <laughs> so I didn't know how to do it. And that's just because I, I really wanted this, that part of town. Oh, it's not right next to the pool. Over there we have the retirement home. Uh, and this abomination is the nuisance family home. Um, yeah, the neighbors hate them. <laughs> They keep adding to their house and they don't care about aesthetics. So uh, they're lucky they're living on the outskirts of this nicer area, but you know, they're not liked. And this is like, see, now I have like a whole street of trailers. Fun fact, this one is more expensive than this one. Somehow, I don't know what I did. <laughs> I think I put in too much stuff. And it's fine. Oh, nice hot dogs. Uh, yes, they've been burning for quite a while, but I think they're safe to eat. So I'm going to have Lucy eat them. There you go. Eat those. You don't have to serve all of them. People can just take a hot dog if they want one. And you can, can't you put it? on the table, like so. There you go. Oh, I forgot what Alexander was doing, but yes, he was uh, bothered. Oh, we can use this. By his uh, state of uh, cleanliness. So he, he fixed that. I'm not sure I like <laughs> that we have these. Um, can we normalize not having these? It's so weird. These things are the whole reason that you must uh, divide bathrooms into boys and girls. Like if you have stalls like this, or e better yet, like walls and doors around the toilets, which most of the bathrooms have in Sweden, most of them do, then there's absolutely no point in having the girl's bathroom and the boy's bathroom and the other bathroom that you can go to if you're not binary. <laughs> like, mm. like, I don't care who's outside the door when I'm, I'm inside a toilet and I've locked the door. I mean, the completely separate room from anyone else. I don't care who's outside. I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand why I do. Uh, divided into girls and boys but this is the way that this lot was built i didn't build this lot and i know that this is the norm in many places oh hello oh <laughs> i was like who's this it's matt freckles no it's weird freckles because he was here earlier and it's a elvira do i oh i need to i need to sell to these people so that we get people in this is not time for leisurely pleasures. You must work, Alexander. Make money for the family. This is this is how the Goth makes money. The Goth owns like three lots in this neighborhood. Oh, we should hire someone. That's what we should do. Wait, I need to... 
I don't know if I need to do that. We should just hire someone. How do I do that? Oh, I can't because I don't, I'm not the owner. Maybe. Wait, can I just click people and hire them? Yes, I can. So who do I want to hire? Hehe. <laughs> Professor Melissa Mellon. Well, maybe her professor days are over. <laughs> maybe I call her, get her over here or someone. I don't know. We are not calling Tiffany because that would be just awkward. I don't know if I can break up with Sims like this that I don't have. Like I, I have a mod that I can break up with anyone that I'm engaged or married to. But if it's just a love interest, I don't think I can do it. So let's call Melissa. Invite over. Because if we get her to work here long enough, she'll get, become a manager. And we don't have to go here to make money. I think it's just based on time. I'm not sure. How do I do? Oh, I haven't hired it. First, I need to hire her. Then I can manage her. There we go. Uh, forgot about that little step. Where is the hire? Can't I hire her? Oh my goodness. Well, let's talk to her. Maybe she's like off limits because she's a professor, but I kind of want to get it, her out of that because I have, where are you going, Alexander? <laughs> I have um, had way too many Sims having a relation with her, like friends or other. And I think it's time for her to get out of that having a relation with students business but uh, it seems I cannot hire her actually well um, I'm just gonna make sure she's in my spreadsheet I'll move her in somewhere <laughs> she is not I think I removed all the I think I've removed all the the professors because they're like sort of special characters. But I'm gonna just make her selectable so that we can see she is 51 years old. What? Okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. And her name is Melon. Like friend or I don't know and I'm gonna put her down as a townie and she is alive and she is aged 51 apparently and she is an elder there now we gotta make her unselectable again there you go I was just having a little peek at her. Actually, we, I'm kind of curious. <laughs> I'm going to do it again. So, what is her? She's unemployed, it says here. Hmm. I, I'm sure she has some sort of uh, special flags uh, or something. Okay, then. Well, we'll try and call someone else. We could just hire some rando that we find, but I'd rather it not be an elder actually. Because like if I, if I hire them, then I have to put them in the spreadsheet if they're not already there. And uh, like they could die at some point. Oh my goodness, sales, may I help you? Lucy, you might be able to help a little bit. 
There you go. She's also in need of a shower. Oh well. Okay. What about <laughs> what about Gordon King? Maybe I need to talk to him first because it seems we're not friends. But they have a pretty good relationship, so I think they're gonna turn friends pretty fast. So, you know, Alexander doesn't make the best choices. Because um, <laughs> Gordon King is obviously n not a law abiding citizen. What has happened? Why aren't they friends? I don't understand. Let's see if he wants to come over. So he's gonna hire him because he likes him. Uh, invite over. Let's see if that if he comes over. I can't leave the house. I'm waiting for the phone repairman. What's what's your issue? Okay. Well then. Okay. Then then he he will not. Then. Help this customer. Why don't why don't you? And then so let's let's instead call Chandler Oldie because why do I keep clicking that? Because they're friends. Can my friend come over too? Yes, you you can bring a friend to my lot where I charge people to be. <laughs> That's fine. Alright, what is going on? Well, we were making money, I think. What's the cash flow? Cash flow is bad. Why is cash flow bad? What are our expenses? I haven't bought anything, I think. That's weird. Wait, this is average priced. I don't know, but you can ring up these customers. And there, hey, where are you going? <laughs> okay. Well, here's Chandler. We can greet him. Once we charge for these. Or, you know, we cannot. <laughs> I don't like it when they just drop actions out of the queue. I think like greet actions are dropped because while I have it in the queue, the sim that I'm about to greet will have to stand around waiting for me. And mama don't like that or something. Hello, do you want to work for me, please? Um, why did I only have the hire option on Elvira over there? Maybe I should hire her, introduce her to him too. See? I can hire him. I cannot. Oh, I can. Uh, <laughs> I can hire weird freckles. Is that why? Why is it doing this? I don't understand. Am I just missing the hire option? I don't think so. This is weird. I don't understand. Is it because he's a townie? Can I not hire townies? And also, why don't I have an option on the phone to hire people? Is it just because this lot belongs to Cornelis? So maybe Alexander and Lucy are not at liberty to do that. 
Why do you call the bestness and ask for Diana? She's obviously not here. We could hire Elvia. Yes, we can hire her. Let's just hire her. I don't know. She has no talent. This it will be a great opportunity for you because you know nothing. <laughs> Congratulations, you are hired. Thank you. You should go and try and scare away customers so that I don't have to deal with them. Management. Um, wear casual clothes. Yes. yes, do that. And also assign uh, sell items. Because we we need to we need someone constantly doing that on this lot, and then I just took her job. <laughs> Don't do that! I was going to restock. <laughs> and in the beginning, she's gonna do bad because they they're not good at selling <laughs> before they get any badges. So she will just uh, do more harm than good right now, but in the long run, it's a good idea. And she's immediately not feeling well. Well, that's not my problem, is it? Okay, you need to go and have a break, apparently. Uh, wait, where's the break? Did I? No, she she might have taken a break on her own. Go to the toilet. How do I make you go to the toilet? <laughs> oh, I'm going to take your job now because you did a bad job. Go, go pee. Will she? No, she'll do something else. What are you doing? Woman? Like, what are you trying to accomplish? Oh, you need a hot dog. Okay. Well, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, we stop these. Well, we did accomplish what we wanted to do. We hired someone and we stopped the fire. That was the main thing. So, I saved now. No fire. <laughs> No more fire on this lot. Uh, but they should be getting home because it, it's dark and they should like make dinner or they have a butler, but they, they should read the nighttime story for uh, Diana or something. I don't know. Where's the... There it is. So call a taxi and go home. Also, you know, Lucy. You can reset this so that if I go here with another sim, it will be cheaper for me. There you go. And we, I think, what can we set it to? Can we set it to one? Really? Ah, see, seems we could. I don't know. Yes, go home. One could also stop charging customers. Uh, but you know. I just realized I don't actually know the difference between the ultimate collection and the super collection. But it seems to me that the ultimate collection should be the superior one. And I hope that's true. Because <laughs> that's the one I have. Anyway, if you wanted to know the version number of the game, it's up here. <laughs> it's like one. 
0.17.0.66. Very important. I don't know what to do with that number. It's it's just there. You could probably get it off the screen if you wanted to, but it doesn't bother me that much. So that was Alexander and uh, Lucy's day. She didn't die, incidentally. That's great for her. <laughs> I like that for her, not dying, you know, that's, that's good. Now everybody is away. I have the community time mod, so they will not be here for nine hours now. But at one o'clock, uh, uh, Cornelius probably gets home from school and we'll make him do his homework if he hasn't done that yet. He's doing slightly better in school, but still has horrible grades. He is now a C student and C students can go to college when they're 20. And Cornelius is going to turn 18 today. So he brought a ho uh, home from school, a friend. He brought a friend home from school today. So let's talk to her. Yeah. Is he involved with someone? I don't know. Who is he attracted to? Only her? Oh my. And he is bi, so he has options, you know, I would have thought. But he... Apparently this Sadie person is the first person that he has ever met that he has felt attracted to. Sadie is in the spreadsheet. That's good. And she is a bit younger than him, but it's The Sims, so it's fine. <laughs> They're both teens. So. He's gonna watch out. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you can put it there. You need to... What are you doing? <laughs> Why can't you put it over here? Like a soul. That will work great, you know? I don't know, maybe that mod is broken too. <laughs> Stuff keep happen keeps happening. Okay, so uh, the rule is when you bring a pretty girl or anyone from school, you need to have a chat with them. Uh, they already have a bit of a... Okay. Can I watch her do that? Watch. They already have, like, a relationship, but I want them to, like, you know, talk to. And then you can do the homework, because you want to. So, like, I'm sorry, but could you stop? Oh, now he wants to go, he needs to go to work. So, I'm sorry. None of that. <laughs> there will be none of that. Okay. So he just immediately went away. But he made a sort, sort of friend in school today. That's great. Okay, well, Diana, are you going to stay here? You don't have a job? Good. Oh, look how happy she is. She wants to become friends with Coral Pleasant. Uh, I think her name is. Is it Coral Broke? She's the daughter of uh, Angela Pleasant and Dustin Broke. Somebody's calling, apparently. And she also brought a friend, friend home. Well, I hope it's Coral. Who is it? And it's not Coral. It's Willow, Trim Willow Trimble. Okay. Chat with her then. She's a reincarnated sim. I do this thing in the retirement home. In, instead of killing people, I reincarnate them. Uh, I'm not sure I did it correctly with Willow. I'm, I have changed my method. What I do now is I turn them into children. Uh, and then I go into... I turn them into children and then I use the summoning bush. And I, like, you can do make me a townie. 
uh, not throwing it for Diana. <laughs> That's what I do. And and then I close the game. I go into Simpy. I rename them something, and then I remove all their relationships with other sims so they don't know anyone um i don't bother with the memories because that those are memories from a past life <laughs> <laughs> so and i don't think they will and also so if we make willow we can see make selectable willow trimble uh oh she's one of those oh roommate satisfaction well that's funny you can see she has some uh, skills already. They all get an F in school. Uh, because this... If they haven't attended school in a previous life, you know, they don't have a grade. So that... That, um, that bit in the programming code is null, which is the same... This is interpreted the same as zero. Um, null means nothing, not zero. <laughs> it's different, but it's t interpreted the same by the game. So it, it says you don't have good grades, you have zero a number here, you are uh, an F student and should be taken away. So um, lately I have just been giving them a C in SimPE. So I change their name, I remove all the memories, no, not memories the relationships and I get give them a C uh, I haven't changed their aspiration so you can see she is a child and she has an aspiration that's fine I don't like if you remove that there is a risk that they don't get it later so uh, yeah the game is uh, why why isn't C considered a uh, visitor there you go we don't want her selectable because the social worker might actually come i think that's not good oh i wish sadie was learning piano because like why why is why isn't she i think there's a mod for that but i haven't found it why are you talking to Seth now? You should, if anything, you should be talking to Co uh, what's her name? Coral. So, so hang up on Seth and call Coral instead. She's related to Seth somehow. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> How did this happen? Yeah, I still don't know. Well, it's like a cousin or something. Wait. Right. This, this is the way. So you go to Alexander. You go to Cassandra. It's her son. There, there it is. <laughs> so, yeah, that cousin. Yes. But call Coral. there and just talk because uh, Diana followed Coral home the other day so they're becoming good friends and they are not related there's food call to meal guests There! Friends! And now she also wants to be friends with Willow. Is she going to be a, a popularity sim or...? We don't know. Willow, why aren't you getting food? Get some food.
I think it's lucky the butler is here. Otherwise, Diana would be left at home alone. Well, good we have a butler. Uh, because if you leave your, ho your kids at home alone, <laughs> the social worker shows up and says, this will not do. I will take these kids away. So that's not nice. Why are you eating out here, Willow? I don't think I re renamed this sim. I think her name was already Willow Trimble, but oh well. Maybe she will become friends with Sadie instead. When is Cornelius coming home? Now. <laughs> He's coming home now. <laughs> and everybody grew up, or, you know, uh, aged up. That's what I wanted to say. So, Alexander is now 30. Lucy is 27. Cornelius is 18. And Diana is 7. And he should be getting home now. There you go. And Cornelius has been promoted to Dolphin Tank Cleaner Level 2. It's been suggested that dolphins are the most intelligent species on the planet. So rightly so, they need people to clean up after them. Of course. <laughs> um... Thoughts of calculus, waveform, particle physics, and balancing beach balls on one's nose leave little time to t tidy up a tank. You've got mechanical skills, they don't, so use them. He now works from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. All right. And he still hasn't talked to Sadie, so I'm trying to... I want to have him do that. He isn't hungry, so he doesn't... <laughs> and he works in his swimsuit apparently he does want to go and in, get into private school I think well how are you gonna do that when he works at the time where the principal would get home or get here that, that won't work does he have a day off at some point no He doesn't. Oh well, now that he's talked to Sadie, he should be doing his homework. I love that, like, I didn't put these pigtails on uh, Diana. They, uh, she grew up into them and I thought that was perfect because of Cassandra. <laughs> so, so uh, they're the hereditary uh, pigtails. What what are, what is your issue? Oh, you want you have your board, so try and play cops and robbers, perhaps. And maybe you'll have some fun. I don't know where she put her homework. Did she put it up here? She did. No, this is Cornelia's homework. Uh. Where did Diana... Doesn't she have a designated desk? It seems she does not. And someone put the newspaper on her desk. That's not nice. I'll just put these in here. And I don't know who this is, but I'm going to sell it. Because we'll quickly fill up the house with those if we're not careful. We have this desk locator. There. So she can like claim this desk but somewhere she should have put her homework down somewhere and I don't know where that's a magazine but she also doesn't have any want to do her homework there it is that's weird why am I so confused there. Yes, 
you be a good boy and do your homework so you can go into college at some point in your life. If if he gets a B, he can go when he's 19. And he's going to be 19 after school tomorrow, so that that's probably when he'll go. If everything goes to plan, it's autumn, so doing the homework should go fast. She's playing with her little friend. I want to take no... And then they froze. I don't know what happened. Stop that. Stop it. Come on. What is happening? Preset. Okay. But take note of this. Uh, we, sh we were going to claim this desk. When we select play, we have all these options. The Sims 4 could never. She still wants to be friends. She's gonna go home at any, any time now, but... We can, we can try to play more with her. I don't know where she went. <laughs> where did she go? There she is. Oh, she's saying goodbye. Okay. I can't believe how late it is. Yeah, it, it kind of is. And Lucy and Alexander is still not home. <laughs> oh, well. Wait, do we have baby names selected for Lucy? I don't think she's going to have her baby until tomorrow. We do not. So, we need to figure that, figure that out. Okay, so if it's a girl, we go on the mother's side. And we already have a Diane. We have a Diana, but we're not going to get a Diane and a Diana. That would be silly. So next one is Tiffany. That's cute. Oh my goodness, why is it like this? Okay. Names. We have Tiffany. But what if it's twin girls? We need another girl name. And we ran out of girls in this generation to select from. Can we go further though? We could find Melinda. We already have a Melinda in the family. <laughs> so not bad. We have kind of pleasant... Wait, what is going on? Yes, okay. The, they are related... The verbs are related to the pleasants. So I don't, I don't have a kinda yet because it's kind of weird. <laughs> but I'm, I'm gonna allow it. If we get twin girls, I'm gonna name one. Kinda. Okay, so for boys, we go on Alexander's side um, and we have Gunther. Do I have a Gunther? I don't think I put a Gunther in my game yet. Gunther. No, I did not. So we still have that. Gunther. And if it's twin boys, we also have Simis to select from so okay so we have the names i don't think it's possible to get triplets in my game because i don't i think you need a mod for that and i haven't put anything like that in to my knowledge <laughs> are you tired Yes, you are. Okay, well then go to bed. She didn't want to do her homework, so she's not doing them. But she has a B plus. She will not be taken away right at this second. Who is this? Agnes Crumblebutton is <laughs> stalking us. Oh, look at this. It's the spooky goth mansion after all. So we get we get the spooks. 
And we have one spook right over out there. I know they're called ghosts. But I said spooks because I did. <laughs> That's the whole reason. All right, did you do your homework to completion? I think you did. That is great. Now you can play video games. Wait, what is his hobby? It's fitness. How do you have fun when you're doing fitness? I don't know. Well, we could try jump rope. I don't know if that's fun. Is it? It should be fun. It is. Fantastic. Okay. Well, he does want to buy a cell phone. He can go now that Alexander and Lucy is home. So, okay. Well, I'm not. I'm not unlocking the the college one. Uh, no way. <laughs> so we are. No, I need to wait until they're properly here. I think. Who's this? Yeah, you're tired. Go, go and sleep. Drive to community lots. Don't bring anyone. And go to the all-in-one shack because you can buy cell phones there. And the visitor controller has made it so that only teens will show up. So that's where I have the teens meet. So he'll just go over there. He could just talk to Sadie, you know, but apparently not, that's not what he wants to do. <laughs> He's not very focused on getting a mate, um, but I'm not worried about it. We, we will get, he will have to produce an heir at some point because he's the heir of the goth mansion, but... <laughs> Like, he has time. Well, he might die, of course. And then I will have to figure out some sort of line of succession. <laughs> but let's not worry about that right now. Oops. Look, he has a car. Uh, he wanted to, he wanted to buy a cell phone, so I'm going to buy a cell phone for, for him e Even though he lost his wand when he changed lots. They do that. He wants to gain a mechanical skill point I don't think you can do that here. I don't think there's a uh, a Book case even though it's called uh, the all-in-one shack So I should probably put a bookcase in There we go. Don't you, do I need to pay for it? Do I just have it now? Okay. All right. We should meet some uh, fellow teenagers. It's autumn. Why are you in the pool? You, you'll get wet and then you'll get cold. <laughs> I forgot about temperature. We have temperature. Look, it's in the green. I don't know. This I always think is Lester Pleasant. Let's change his hair. That's what I usually do. Change appearance and maybe I'll not mix them up anymore. Hey. There. All right, uh, he has straight hair, but wouldn't this be fun? <laughs> uh, this one I already have, I think. No, it's this one I have on uh, Davis, I think. So he could be sporting this one or... Oh no, I don't like it. So many different choices. This makes no sense. <laughs> Wait. This is awful. But I, I kind of want to do it. 
anyway. This is just, what are you doing with your life kind of thing? What is this? Chain mail. Okay. Maybe he woke up and thought he would do this. I don't know. I, I think, I think I'm gonna put this on him. No, wait, I can't decide. Oh my goodness, this is hard. Okay. I, I just feel like he, he is, um, he, he has that hair. <laughs> and now I don't think he's Lester Pleasant. Okay. Fantastic. Hello, Dolmar. That hairstyle is really popular, isn't it? But he has black hair at least, so I don't I don't mix him up with someone, I think. I don't know. Maybe jerk when he gets older. Uh but they're related, so it's fine. Hello, Brooke. Do I know all these people? Yes, I do. You don't need to say hello to Brooke. You already know her. You know, already know you're not attracted to her at all. I just want him to meet some... Oh my goodness, why would you do that? Some fellow humans, you know? Do you know him? Did you greet him? No? No? He got away. <laughs> There's the toilet. Use the toilet. I'm gonna try not to stay too long because he has homework to do too. No, he doesn't. I, I already made those. Uh, but he has some sleeping to do before he goes to school. That's what I uh, wanted. Here's Melinda Dreamer. Greet her. And there's the witch that was lagging my game up. <laughs> he already knows Melinda, but you know, hello. Kiyoshi Tsang was just fostered by Brandy Newbie. Uh, like, she was Brandy Broke, but, uh, you know, she remarried with. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> and, um, but he left her for Angela Pleasant. So now she's single again. But before he left her, they took in Kiyoshi. So he's a foster child with Brandy now. Oh, hello. He kind of likes Gina. But you know, she's in, she is in trouble. Uh, okay. Sometimes that happens, I don't know. Uh, I don't think we're gonna meet someone. And he he doesn't even have a want to meet someone, so I'm not gonna torture him with that anymore. <laughs> but he met some people. Now he knows more people, I think. So, that's fine. And there was no fight. There hasn't been a fight in a while. Thank goodness. So now everyone's probably asleep. I think. Alexander is eating rotten food. Don't do that. Stop it. And clean this up instead. Lucy is not starving. <laughs> Just checking. So clean this up and then join Lucy. I would like to ignore the 
dirty dishes because the butler can take care of it tomorrow. But when when they're out, someone might eat them. They might get sick. They might start a plague. We don't want that. Maybe you should talk to this girl and ask her to go home. <laughs> Actually. Can we... There you go. Get her to stop. It's in the middle of the night. Aren't, don't you have school? There. And then we can ask her to leave. What is happening? How did that dog get in there? Chase off. Goodbye. Oosh. <laughs> go away. There we go and go to bed. Oh, we have a lot. Lots and lots of bills. Maybe we should take care of that before something bad happens. It's almost 3000. Oh my goodness. This is not the computer. This is the computer. Uh, withdraw. Okay. Uh, let's get 4000 out and then you could pay bills. And then you can go to bed. There he comes. I really love the community time mod. Like I was actually avoiding going to um, community lots before because I got the double time to play The Sims and I didn't like it. <laughs> But now I, I just feel like, especially if it's a big family, let's divide it up and have half of them go. And then I can just play the other half at home. I think that's great. Did he pay the bills? I think he did. And now he has 91,200 in his bank account. That's still a substantial amount of money. Why did it get up now? <laughs> I don't know. Well, he's hungry. We have some leftovers, I think. Oh, now you want to do your homework. Okay. Well, do homework first, then you can play with toys. She'll probably not um, do it, the entire homework, but that's fine. And Lucy, how hungry are you? <laughs> Clean this up and grab a bowl. Can we call it a meal? No. What? That's weird. Lucy has the day off today because she's pregnant. I don't understand why you get like days off when you're pregnant. You can just go work. <laughs> I don't understand. Well, it depends on what work you have. 
um, maybe she didn't want to stand up selling things all day. Like I work with computers um, and when I was pregnant, I was like, why wouldn't I work? <laughs> I'm just sitting here. If I'm not working, I'm going to sit at my computer at home. Uh, she's... That gosh darn lamp is on, uh, in my way all the time. She still wants to be friends with Gina. Doesn't seem to go too well for her. They're at 45 now, so getting closer, I guess. All right, he wants to get a job in the music career. So let's let's see if there's a job for him now. But first, we're going to have breakfast together. It's going to be nice. Did you have food already? Oh, now you can call to me. That's so weird. Uh, don't do that. Have breakfast cereal. Well, he wants to drive to school. Well, I'm gonna let him. Yeah, she didn't finish her homework. It's fine. It's fine. She has a B. And she wants to do her homework, so she can try and do them after school. Good. Let's remember to save. <laughs> if my calculations are correct, Lucy should be having her baby tonight and she wants to play the piano so she can do that after she tries to call Gina I don't know if she'll make it in time maybe yes Gina where are you there you are just talk I don't know what the obsession between Gina and Lucy is, but they have some sort of connection. Law career. No, we want music. Journalism. Look again. Uh, athletic career. No. So now she wants to become best friends with Gina and she wants to learn physiology. So, okay, let's study physiology then. Politics, politics, politique. Slacker, no, nope, no music career for you. We could, of course, cheat him into the music career, but I do not do that. Well, he, oh, he wants a puppy. Mm, should we get a puppy? Will it be too much? I don't know. We had a cat before. And we lost it because we didn't feed it. <laughs> But okay, he wants a puppy. Let's get a puppy, I guess. He doesn't want a dog. He wants a puppy. Okay. Pet adoption service. And we have one through three puppies. There. And we have one, two, three. So six puppies in total. I'm gonna randomize which one we are going to get because I can't make decisions myself. I get number six. So we're getting this male puppy and I'm gonna call it Max because I, I Googled male puppy names and I'm just going off the list. <laughs> So, do you want to adopt Max? Yes, I do. <laughs> and 
then then they uh, will um, ask us to name the puppy again. I don't understand why it does that twice, but they do. I want to talk to someone about hobby. Let's talk to Gallagher. Don't mess with the staff. Uh, we do not like him. Talk about hobby. Which hobby is yours, Alexander? I keep forgetting his true hobby is nature. So, whoops talk about hobby he doesn't he can't talk about nature well then talk about cuisine there max is here and do some bird watching it's your hobby <laughs> hooray we got a puppy where's the puppy oh wait you need to pick this up you need to take it into the house because you can't get into the house alone like that and if I now go there I think he will bring the puppy we'll see no he will not <laughs> sometimes this is tricky pick it up and go there hello what are you doing why are you walking around out here I didn't tell you to do that. Go. What are you doing? Go eat something so you don't die. <laughs> there, we got the puppy into the house. Fantastic. Now you can, like, give. Snuggle. Snuggle the little puppy. Oh, look at how cute it is. Yippee, yippee, yippee. So cute. Okay. The phone is ringing. Why can I not click the phone? There you go. And we also need to buy pet stuff because I don't think we have them. So we get the fancy bowl, we put it next to the piano here, it's nice. No wait, I'm putting it over here. And also the bone. I always get the white bone because it's a bone, it should be white. And, <laughs> and then we're getting a nice pet bed there. Fantastic. <laughs> and now he wants to get a kitten as well. No, Alexander, you will not have more than one pet because I say no. <laughs> because it's going to be chaos in here. We, we won't have it. Hi, Alexander. Is Diana really able to talk? Uh, why aren't you in school, Seth? That's weird of you. Fill this bowl. Oh my goodness. When is the baby due? <laughs> what the, I want the baby to get here. I want to know who it, who is in here. It's a very big belly. She got like the stretch marks and everything, I think. Wait. I just realized Lucy is friends with Gina and Gina needs a home should Lucy take Gina in to foster that would solve the whole like baby situation and, and I wouldn't have to build <laughs> I wouldn't have to build a second prison to get her into that but I might do it anyway because it's fun but then the baby wouldn't have to grow up in foster care because it would be born here <laughs> yeah I'm gonna invite Gina over and I'm gonna send some money to the orphanage and have her fostered here wait i can't do it right now because it's tuesday well we, we could 
we could socialize with her but the orphanage is still on monday so we could do it like i i would have to stop playing this family why didn't i think of this or, oh they weren't friends earlier <laughs> that's why i didn't think of it okay well missed opportunity well maybe on wednesday we'll we'll see how old is she gina is let's see on monday gina has an age well, my spreadsheet she's 17 she will like grow up soon and as it looks like now her uh, future doesn't look all that great i think she, she will um, not go to college i think but that's uh lucy can relate she also got pregnant when she was a teenager and she didn't get to go to college because of it but she's doing all right for herself <laughs> you know but she is sitting in the chair where where uh, lilith got scared to death by a ghost so um i'm gonna keep an eye on her it, it's not night time but you know still And uh, this plate is disgusting. Where's the butler when you need him? Oh, he's in there. Scrubbing. All right. When Cornelius first began taking drum lessons at school, it was something like a stampede on the Serengeti. Things have changed and recently Cornelius has been rocking the house. So much so that he's been offered the first chair for percussionists in the school band. Cornelius earned 200 from the school from extra performance he'll be attending. Well, that's lovely. I won't be bothered putting that into the bank account because this is like his household. So this money here is his. So usually I, I put teenagers earnings in their bank account but he has over 90,000 already so he's not bother bothered with that he's just happy he did well with the drums you know oh really she is in school really now okay how did I not think about that she wants to learn lifelong happiness and physiology uh, I think I don't know let's do physiology because she kind of needs it. She's not fit. <laughs> the carpool for Cornelius will arrive in about one hour. He's doing extremely well in school. He is? Oh, he got an A? He had a C. He skipped two grades up. I didn't know that could happen. I thought they could only get one grade better at each day, but apparently I was wrong. There we have mail. Get mail. Well, that's fantastic. So this means that he can go. Uh, well, still tomorrow. He he could already go. What is happening? Cornelius has a trouble. Okay, I don't know why my game does that. Oh. Yeah, I had this problem in this particular house where children would come home from school and they will glitch out and not get their homework. And I don't understand why it's happening. Well, play with toys. Why? She, so she got here by glitching. It's not good. And also, why is Diane at home? She shouldn't be home from school until uh, until three o'clock. Can she walk? Can I get her back to school? She should be in school. Like, what? What is going on? I don't know. Well, there she goes. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Bills are awful. We will not be paying all bills. We need to extract money 
first. And today we didn't go to the business. We could go now, of course. Um, but since bills are like 3,000, like it, it's depleting the bank account. <laughs> Um, well, too bad. There must be some challenge to, to keeping a mansion, you know. Now he's only have 88,000 on his bank account. So, uh, I mean, the money is decreasing. But he, for some reason, he has a job. <laughs> I don't know why. He wants a scholarship, Young Entrepreneurs Award. So, um, so he must reach the top of a teen career. And I think there are only three levels. So if he studies mechanical, then he might be able to do it. Because he needs to do that today and he's in a bad mood. Okay. Uh, play the Sims. <laughs> then you'll get him in a good mood. But I don't think I don't think it's gonna happen this. He also wants to gain a mechanical skill point. Oh he's also dirty. Oh well. Too bad. Yeah, no, <laughs> that will not be possible. Wait, aren't you going to work like now? Oh my goodness, there's so much things. Drive to work. So many things to keep track of. And Diana brought home Dean Dreamer, I do believe that is. Well, I guess play cops and robbers with him. I'm gonna play until the baby is born so that we know who the baby is. <laughs> We're gonna find out the names. I have, I have put out the names from the family trees from the family tree. So if it's a girl, it's gonna be Tiffany. And if it's a boy, it's gonna be Gunther. But if it's twin girls, it's gonna be Tiffany and Kinda. And it, if it's twin boys, it's gonna be Gunther and Simis. And those are all name, names from the family tree. I always do uh, the parents, grandparents first because they usually did <laughs> by the time you get children <coughs> wait he Dean is in private school but Diana is not so how did he she meet him at school hmm that doesn't make any sense I wondered about this well not much to do about that. I I hope there's a mod for that because I would like to uh, for for uh, children not to meet each other if they're not in the same school. Coral Brook is no longer family friend. Well, uh, well, that's too bad, I guess. We can't keep track of all the little friends. Yeah, she she has many friends. Lucy, are you keeping on track with your food? Uh, maybe you should serve lunch meat sandwiches. That's fire safe and everything. Oh, and Gallagher thinks Lucy is hot. Well, Lucy is wandering around in her nightgown. I told you, you're a goth now. You can't do that. 
<laughs> you need to put put on some clothes and then serve lunch. There you go. Like you can't wander around like this when you have uh, when you're entertaining, you know. This is fine. At least you're dressed. I mean. She's still in a bad mood. Let's get her fun up some more before we try and clean her off and do the homeworks. Maybe I can just queue up to have a bath. Take a bubble bath. I don't know if they gain fun from that, but I, I uh, imagine they enjoy it. <laughs> Lucy earned a cooking skill point. Well, and learned to prepare a new meal. What can she do now? She can do spaghetti. That's fantastic. So let's serve the food. Alexander, you can like come and eat. Everyone else is going to, I think. Even if I wanted to keep playing, the rule says I have to stop at morning at uh, Wednesday morning because uh cornelius can then go to college and he wants to so i need to like get the college uh in sync with everyone's ages uh, so that he can go there uh the ages are now alexander is 31 and Lucy has turned 28 because it's six, six o'clock. And Cornelius is 19 and Diana is eight. And Cornelius will be, since he got an A, he will be going to college tomorrow. So we can uh, try and call college and see uh, what scholarships we can have. I don't think he can get any. But, I mean, at least he tried to get one, but he, I don't think, like he has one dead parent, but you need both dead parents to get the orphanage, uh, the orphan scholarship. Apply for scholarships. Oh, he got a scholarship. Congratulations, Cornelius, you qualify for the Sim City Scholars Grant. Oh, because he has such good grades. Oh, that's fantastic. It seems to me when I put my Sims in college that they only get a, a scholarship for the first semester i'm contemplating if i should like note their scholarship and give them that each semester but i'm not i'm not sure that is good maybe not and I'm also not sure when you move them to college, they have like, before you move them in to the dorm, they have like a household fund. And I usually just put that in their bank account when they move in. But, <laughs> however, sometimes I feel like there's a lot of money in the, in the dorm household. So maybe they're actually getting the scholarship after they move in. Not sure about that. Something is going on that I'm not keeping track of.
Yeah, I think that's enough playing for you, Diana. You need to, like, you want to do the homework? You should do the homework. Did she get homework now? Yes, okay. Well, I don't know what happened there at one o'clock, but now she has two little homework books. So if she... If she has a shower or, like, a bubble bath, Maybe she, she should have the bubble bath here and then use the toilet. Then, if she's not too hungry, she will do the homework. Awesome. Alexander is just playing with the dog. Can we teach it something? No. We'll have to wait until it grows up, I guess. Isn't it? Did did Lucy get a baby bump? It was so so weird. Like the camera zoomed to her, but she didn't do the animation. But she must have gotten the second baby bump because she's. I think she will have her baby this evening. He still wants that mechanical skill point. I'm going to try and give him that because it will help him in college so he can study mechanical after he cleans himself up. Everyone gets so dirty all the time. I don't understand why. <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> He wants to learn couples counseling. That will probably be a good idea since you're married to a romance sim. Study uh, couples counseling. But Lucy has been good so far. Did I give her a secondary aspiration? No, I did not. Well, see, we can do that. And let's see so she randomized to be a roman sim when she turned teen but her sign is cancer so that the rules dictate <laughs> that every cancer sim is a true family sim so i'm gonna put her in secondary aspiration family and she will start getting these kind of wants and maybe maybe this is when you know she settles down a bit diana had quite a lot of points okay everyone is settled now so that I, I've been waiting for that a long time for Lucy to get her secondary aspiration. And now she got it. Fantastic. Um and I think Alexander wait. How's this happened? He's a family aspiration already. My spreadsheet says that he's a pleasure sim. But mm, I think he changed in college and I didn't change the spreadsheet. So I'm just note that down now. And if he should get a secondary aspiration, yeah, see, he's a cancer. <laughs> then we're going to uh, calculate that from his interests. But I like to do it. They, these may change sometimes. What is happening? Okay. So I like to do that like at the moment they should get their secondary aspiration. So I'm not going to pre-calculate it as sometimes I do, especially for Sims in college. Because you'll get this, do you want to change it now? And you can't go check their stats. You just have to change it immediately. And this is new. Before, I, if they were already in their true aspiration, 
I just let them have like keep that but change their um, attraction thingies over here, the chemistry. But now I'm actually saying like everyone changed in college. So if you're already in your true aspiration, you change to your secondary, like your true secondary aspiration based on your interests. And then when you get a secondary aspiration, you get the true aspiration as a secondary aspiration. Did you follow that? Because I hardly did. <laughs> Sometimes words are plentiful. Everyone is studying, except Diana, which will be studying soon. Cornelius did get his point. He now wants to buy a toy ma making bench. I'm sorry, Cornelius. What is that? Uh, that, uh, that, uh, that will not do. Does he have no homework? Uh, I don't know. Does he truly have no home? It doesn't matter. He's going to college anyway. Because he's a nice student. I don't. But he can just go to sleep. And Diana should go to sleep once she's <laughs> fed up with doing homework. She might be able to do them all. I don't think she learned the homework skill. There's a skill, you know. No, she did not. Um, so maybe if she stops doing that, we can have Lucy teach her. It will be a little bit fiddly, but it will benefit her. She needs to want to do the homework. We can, like, it's... It may be bending the rule a little bit, but I'm going to allow it. Ask Lucy for homework help so that you don't start with playing boats. <laughs> I usually direct them from both directions. One of the actions will fail and the other one should succeed. There you go. <laughs> well, she is tired. This means the homework will be done faster and then all subsequent homework will be done faster. But once you're fed up with this, go sleep. Oh my goodness, there's a fire. No, why? Okay. Alright. You can just ask Alexander for homework help because he seems to be in a good mood at you sleep a little bit it will be in the middle of the night it's fine <laughs> uh, what is what are you doing oh you you're learning couples counseling that's great All right, nothing to do now, but wait, mostly. Maybe Alexander, why isn't Lucy having the baby? Well, the spreadsheet says it's due, but maybe she's like overdue. I don't know. Maybe it, it, maybe I messed it up by going to the the community log for nine hours. I don't know. We'll see. She's doing okay, but after she's done sleeping, she we should have her go eat. Sometimes love just isn't enough and that's where I can step in and help a struggling couple rekind rekindle the flame. Why can't you help your own? Well, maybe not. Maximize the creativity skill he wants. What? 
Okay, he wants six grandchildren. That's why he keeps wanting to have kids. Um, well then. Let's see if we can manage this. Oh no. Help Diana with homework. So I want her to finish the homework. I want these slippers. They look awesome. But my feet are usually very hot, so I usually just take slippers off. But I, I like the idea of them. <laughs> What is that option I see in OBS suddenly? Star guest star. I don't know what that is. If you know what it is, please tell me. Probably doesn't matter. Okay, have some burnt hamburgers. Okay, I can't take it anymore. I'm gonna do an ultrasound. <laughs> Pregnancy scan. Uh, there's just b one baby in there and she has been pregnant 68 hours which means there's seven hours left okay that's that's just wrong I'm, g I'm gonna she I'm gonna speed it up because she was due and I messed it up by going to to the community lot so it's not really cheating not really oh my god there's cornelia goth go away i think i named cornelius after cornelia <laughs> <laughs> Why did I do it like that? I don't know. He should be called Gunther. I think. Maybe. No, he shouldn't. He should be named something on Don's side. Oh, right. Because, because Cassandra was angry with Don. So, because uh, Cornelius is the son of Don and Cassandra. Cassandra was angry with Dawn because he left her at the altar, so she didn't name him um, Camelo, <laughs> like Dawn would have wanted. So she just went ahead and uh, used her grandmother on her father's side for some reason. I don't know <laughs> exactly my thought process over there, but. That, that's what happened. There, she now learned the homework. Now she doesn't want to do this, this homework. But she does want to get an A plus report card. And in order to do that, she needs to... Wait, could she, couldn't you like ask Alexander to help you with that too? Because it will be faster. Alexander, don't don't walk away. Help Diana, because you you can do you can totally do that and have time to pee. No, she doesn't want to. Oh my goodness, why not? Okay, play with toys then. What is her hobby? It is unknown. Well, finally. We have the baby time. I am going to save and I'm going to think back. Did I re-randomize? I, I do believe I did. Let's see if we have a little Tiffany or a little Gunther. Those are the names, right? Pretty sure. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. I sometimes turn this off. I hope I hope that was in time, <laughs> so that we get the the cinematic because it's so cute. 
And we are gonna save again because, you know. There's a new family member member on the way, and we get the cinematics. Fantastic! She gives birth in the dining room next to the baby picture. That's nice. Don't remember who painted. I think Darren pa painted that. And it's obstructed. Where's the baby? There's the fridge. <laughs> well, it's a boy. It's little Gunther. Little Gunther is born. Little Gunther Goth. That's a mouthful to say. Oh look, he, he looks exactly like Lucy. Oh my god, he's so cute. I'm gonna save before something happens. You never know. And we will take a nice picture of the newborn. And this nice setting. Ah, can always crop later. There. And that's where we leave the Goth family for today. And I'm gonna go, oops, this is not the right window. I'm gonna go on Twitch and see if we can find someone to raid as per usual. In the Sims 2. Oh, we have some other people playing The Sims 2. Let's try this person. And see if we're allowed to raid them. Sometimes we are not. There we go. Yes. So. I'm going to leave you with this lovely image of Lucy with little baby Gunther Goth. And. Oh, he should probably have the junior name. I will just add that later. Let's see. Yes. So Gunther should be Gunther Goth Jr. But I'll fix that later. So <laughs> until next time, have a super duper time and take care, stay safe and stay out of fighting <laughs> like the Sims. Well, okay, bye.